This is Astrophysics, this is Surveying the Stars Lesson 2, and this one's Luminosity and Power. Alright, so what is luminosity? So luminosity is simply the power output of a star. So luminosity is power. So luminosity is power, and that's energy output over time. Power is energy over time, very basic equation that you already know. And the unit is obviously the watt, or joules per second. And as I've said, the brightness of a star depends on a star's luminosity. All right, so I'm gonna give you another equation, which you probably already know. So intensity of radiation. So intensity is equal to power over area in the unit, watts per square meter. And an example of this, at the Earth's surface, the average intensity of sunlight is about 1,400 watts per square meter, or 1.4 kilowatts per meter square. Right, so I'm going to ask you to do one question. So it's quite a, a common exam question. Sun's luminosity question. So I want you to pause this and have a go at this one. See how you get on. And then I'll take you through the answer. Right, let's see how this one's gone then. So calculate the luminosity of the sun. If the average intensity of sunlight at the Earth is 1,360 watts per meter square, we know the distance from the sun to the Earth is 150 times 10 to the 6 kilometers, which is just one astronomical unit. And obviously the sun's radiation will spread out spherically. Right, so intensity is power per unit area. So we know the intensity is 1,360. And what we need to do to get the power output is to find the area. And it's the area of this sphere. So what we need is the area of the sphere that's coming out. So the area of the sphere is given by 4 pi r squared. So let's rearrange. So intensity times area will be equal to the power. So intensity, 1,360 watts per meter square, multiplied by the area. So it's going to be 4 pi r squared. And the distance r is the distance from the sun to the earth. So that's going to be multiplied by... 150 times 10 to the power of 9. And then make sure that you square that value. So it's 4 pi r squared, which is the area multiplied by the intensity. And if you put that in your calculator, that will give you the power output, which is 3.85 times 10 to the power of 26 watts, which is obviously an outrageously big number. I think there's a, if you calculated... You can do a calculation for the amount of total, you know, power production on planet Earth. Um, and I think it's something like, if you could harness the sun's total power output for one second, you could power the planet for about a thousand years. So the power output is that. And the luminosity is obviously the same thing. So the sun's luminosity is this 3.8 times 10 to the power of 26. So that's a common exam question. And hopefully that's cleared up a few things. And now you know that luminosity is indeed just power. Alright, so thanks for watching, and I'll speak to you soon.